Well, good morning, friends. It's Tracy from Nova Scotia Living, and it is 20 after 11. I was up early, had my coffee, all that stuff. Evie's here now, and I'm about to get two kind of little roast beefs in the slow cooker. I put onion, gar onion, garlic powder, and some Montreal seasoning spice, and some beef bouillon. I put some on the bottom layer and some on the top, and I added a bit of water. So I'm going to put this on probably put it on high because it's a little later on in the day and uh, they're gonna have that for supper with some sides of course so let me get this going all right that's going the boys are uh, downstairs the girls are upstairs my husband's upstairs having a meeting so yeah I just wanted to get that going I meant to start this video earlier that laundry monster I had yesterday is all gone but you can see there's little fragments there so I'm going to vacuum later today but it's a beautiful sunny day out it's not too cold out which is nice and yeah we're going to get through the day get through the day see that basket hanging yeah the kids did that the other day Misha did that and that's for if I need something from upstairs she'll put it in the basket and hang it down <laughs> or if I need something brought up that's small enough she can bring it up yeah. Say good morning, Maze. Good morning. What, yeah. Mom, can I have some to eat? What would you like? Cereal. Cereal. What kind? I can handle oatmeal. Oatmeal? Okay. Yeah. One pack or two? Uh, two. Are you going to eat two? Yeah. Okay. Remember last time I, ate I did. That? Yeah, you wanted three, but. Yeah, anyways, it's just one of those kind of days. One of those kind of days. Yeah. So. Anyways, uh, the sun seems to be getting brighter every day, so that's a good thing. Good thing. Looking forward, taking it day by day. It's all good. All good. So I'll be back. Oh. And, and all right, guys. Uh, and, um, the hair is a little different. A little different. I didn't draw it all the same. No. Well, Mazaya got brought down her blanket that she got for Christmas, and Abby is totally ro rolling over it. But she just drew a picture of this girl with the blue hair. Yeah, the main character. The main character. What website or channel is this from? Um, it's funny. It's funny? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. They so, all have channels, but they don't really go in. Like, they don't really, um. Ooh, like, it looks good, doesn't it? They don't really use their channels anymore. Normally, they all just do it on hers. Because, like, they normally do, like, they're all sisters and brothers. Okay. They normally do videos together. Oh, okay. Anyways, she drew this girl. She just wanted to change the eyes and the mouth. Well, the mouth is the same as eye. The yeah. mouth is the same. But, yeah. She drew a picture for me so I can hang it up of this girl. But look at the detail of the boots or shoes or socks or whatever she's wearing. And she even did that. Yes, watch out, boob. Watch out, jeepers creepers. And, uh, yeah. Let me know down in the comments what one she should do next. Oh, jeepers. I told her any of them would be good. That one or that one. She'll probably do one in between by the time I hear from you guys. But this guy on a Dorito chip or this girl... Looks like she has a cherry cheesecake on top. A cake hat. A cake hat. I can give out all the names. Yeah, she got that, this this, this blanket for my, Christmas. This one's one of my favorite. It's lunar. But then uh, that would be one of the best too. Yeah. That bowl, she's very stylish. And she yeah. Like, she's very stylish. Yeah. She is stylish, yes. And, uh, then that's Jacko. The funniest one, like, is Jacko. Then, so, that one, rainbow. Yeah, she so. Does, she does horrible puns. <laughs> horrible puns? Oh, Aesop's Fables, yeah, yeah. So, anyways, yeah, she, she's quite the artiste. She is. Abby's making an awful racket, I know. But, yeah, I'm going to hang this up so everybody can admire it when they come to our house, eventually. All right, guys, it's 1.40. I just got done peeling a pot of spuds for supper. And I had five leftover carrots from the Easter dinner that I hadn't cooked. 
So I peeled those up. So that's going to go along with the roast beef tonight. I might open a jar of corn or beans or peas or something down in the basement. But I just need to turn those on around 4 o'clock. Like I say, it's 1.41 now. Yeah, I just wanted to get some stuff done. But that roast beef is smelling delicious here in the house. Lovely, lovely. All right, friends. Evie's sleeping upstairs. I have fell asleep up there, but I'm going to get... Yeah, I will in a minute. I'm going to get these spuds going. I need to throw some salt in this water and get the carrots going. And yeah, we'll take the roast beef out of the slow cooker here shortly. All right, here's the two roast beefs. They weren't big ones, but I'm just going to cut them all up, butcher them, and uh, I'll be able to mash those potatoes here in a minute. They're just about done. Then I can divvy up the plates. Easy peasy. Oh, I did make the gravy in the slow cooker. Ooh. I know you can't see very well, but yeah, it's thick. Well, thickish. But that'll be good with some potatoes and on the meat and veggie, whatever. Perfect. I'm going to shut that slow cooker off. That's good. All right, that's sliced up nicely. Sometimes when you do ro uh, roast beef in the slow cooker, it gets all shreddable. It must have been just the type of roast beef, but yeah, still good and hot. I'm going to strain those potatoes and whip them up. Oh, I just went down to the basement and got one of my jars of corn. I did this past February. I'm going to nuke it in the microwave. 5.13, I'm about to uh, dish up. But there's the roast beef. There's some spuds. Some carrots. I put a blob of butter in there. Some salt and pepper and just a pinch of sugar. Some corn. Some of my mustard pickles. And the gravy. So, yeah, this is what they're having. All right, the kids are eating. They're getting their grub on. This is going to be for my teenager. He gets four potato balls. He likes the fatty meat. Some mustard pickles, corn, and carrots. Well, hey, guys, it's Tracy. The next day, Nova Scotia leaving, but it's 2.43 in the afternoon. And my girlfriend, Mally, just helped me move the old stove out of the kitchen. <laughs> We're stove. professionals. We're professionals. <laughs> we had to take off the door. We did. Anyways, my husband's gone to pick up the new stove that we're getting today. I'm just going to lump yesterday and today's video into one. And I would have tried to film it, but it was a circus. It was. Between me and her, we got the stove out from there. And there's a mess there. Not too bad. Let me show you. All right. It's pretty shameful, but that was what was under our stove. I mean, there's probably worse. Not too bad. It could be a lot worse. But there's some stuff. Anyways, we got that out from there between the two of us. I'll show you outside. To this. Yes. Yes. Now, it's bad. I'm going to keep these two racks out of here. It's good for campfires and stuff in case we ever need them. Or if we ever need them for a new stove. I don't know if they're going to fit, but they'll be good for something. They will. I actually kept the uh, other burners that actually worked in this. I took them out and I'm going to keep those in case we ever have to replace new burners if they fit. I need to find out. But yeah, we wiggled and sh shimmied and jimmied and everything and got this stove out of the house. <laughs> Didn't we, Mally? Yeah. Yeah, between me and her, we can do anything. We can topple mountains. Yes, we can. But we got the stove out. We've had a lot of good memories with her. Baked Fancy. lots of bread, lots of meals. Okay. And we're, you know, sending her on to pasture, honestly. She's had a, a good life, and we've had a good life with her. But it's time for a new one. And, uh, yeah, she'll be she'll flying be so high in the sky of ovens. You never know. But... Yeah, I'm going to try to recycle what I can. Yeah, she'll be with Grammy. Grammy will fix her up and, you know, be baking some scones up there with her or something. Gift for Grammy. <laughs> so anyways, yes, that's what we've been doing today. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, my husband just got home with a new stove. The boys are so excited, I'm telling you. Rock and roll, Abby. Say rock and roll. Rock and roll. <laughs> they 
been playing with boxes and blocks and all that stuff. But my teenager and husband are out there. And hopefully they can bring the stove in. It'll be so exciting. So exciting, isn't it, Maze? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Well, okay, guys. It's the next day. It is Thursday. And I'm on my way out of town. I'm actually in the McDoobie's drive through My son is babysitting Evie. I didn't know Medea worked early. I thought she worked later, so he's babysitting for me. I said I'd pick him up on McFlurry. But it is 20 after 12, and I'm thinking I might get like 12 junior burgers and just feed the kids a couple hamburgers when I get home. They haven't had McDonald's in a really long time, and I might just do that. It'll be about 20 bucks, but it'll be worth it because I got a van full of groceries. I did some errands for my neighbor, Saritha, too, which was good because I had to go to those places anyways. So I'll drop that off to her after I get home and get things settled. And yeah that's what's going down it's chilly out today oh it's my turn just a minute yeah so anyways i did i just ordered them each a couple hammers they're like a dollar 69 or something each just like the junior ones it's garbage but it's tasty and it's a treat so that's what they're having but yeah my new stove came yesterday i'll show you when we get home mally cooked eggs on it last night and my husband got up before I did this morning and cooked bacon on it. And it's, uh, oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. It looks so gleaming white compared to my cupboards. Now I want to paint my cupboards. <laughs> but, yeah, to have a, oh, that's something I forgot to get. I went to Walmart to bring back something to, for my neighbor. I went to Superstore. I wore a mask and gloves every time. My face is kind of irritated from the mask. But better safe than sorry. I meant to get one of those oven liners, like those foil oven liners. I don't know if I have one at home. I'm not going to another store now. I'm sick and tired of going to stores. I just want to get home. But, yeah. I stopped a superstore. I didn't get a whole bunch of stuff. Stopped a Sobeys. I picked up her prescriptions and some groceries. I stopped and picked up her income tax. I swung by Dad's. and we, I just met him at the door. Gosh, I miss him so much. He had a couple of bags of treats for the kids and a bag, a present bag for Mally because her birthday is tomorrow. I think the 24th I have to check the date I think it's tomorrow God, she wants to make her own cake so I said you can if you want to she likes making cake so you know usually that's not what happens but she wants to bake the cake so she can oh it's almost my time the lines big yeah I got my son a Mc Oreo McFlurry that's what he wanted so I don't know. It's like the I stopped at Dairy Queen first, but that line was even longer. Would have got him a blizzard. I haven't had one of those. I used to get uh, Smarty blizzards when I used to eat them years ago. But I, that long that line was longer than this one. So, anyways, yeah, I don't know what we're gonna do for supper. I did pick up some hot dogs and some hamburger. My husband and I got some chicken breast too. My husband um, has some stuff out. He might barbecue, but yeah, it's my turn to pay. Bump. So I'll be back in a little bit and when I get home, I'll show you what we got. All right, friends, I got home. I divvied up the hamburgers, so there we go. But this is what I got at Superstore. I ended up getting six pizzas, four the Canadian ones with pepperoni and sausage or something and mushrooms, and two Hawaiian ones. They were on sale for $2.99. That's pretty darn good for something like that. Just to replenish our stockpile because we didn't have any more. <clears throat> I got a thing of burger buns. Some those little blueberry muffins, 50% off. Got these little oatmeal muffin mixes, easy to make with little kids. You probably just add water or something, maybe an egg. But they were 50% off. A red velvet cake mix, 50%. Some chicken bouillon stock powder stuff, uh, 50%. I got two things of chicken breast, 9.49 and 6.48. Thing of hot dogs. Some marble cheese, some pizza mozzarella cheese, two things of mushroom basil sauce, some salsa, some bologna. These will not last two seconds. They haven't had these in a long time. Strawberry and blueberry. Uh, pepperoni, I actually got that at Sobeys. I like yeah, uh, hamburger. Apples were on for $2.99. I got this big thing of Mr. Noodle at Walmart. So that's what I got. I got more stuff to unload, so let me put this away and I'll show you what else I got.
All right, so at the dollar store, I got a little cookie, two of these little so smaller size, 13 by 9 cookie sheets and a bigger one, 11 by 17. Got some more parchment paper. Mazaya really likes these crackers. Crackers. I'd put them in her lunch sometime. They're individually packed, like I think three or four in a package. So I got those, $1.25 each. I got another watering can. Some mustard. Two little lemon juice things. Two cans of sliced peaches. Thing of pineapple. The kids gobble that stuff up so fast. I got some chocolate fudge, pop tarts, two strawberry flavored ones. Some cheese nip crackers, uh, four cans of tomato soup, and I got a bunch of chips, but it's to last the week, you know what I mean, snacks, some party mix, some ketchup chips, some salt and malt vinegar, kettle cooked chips, and some ripple regular chips. And since I got those hot dogs, I got some hot dog buns. Oh, and I got those two white tubs right there on the bench. I have some kinetic sand I'm going to bust out, but I need something to contain it in, so that's what that's, what that's for. So... Let me put this away and oh let me think I got two I didn't put it up on the table two um, pork riblets like what I make boiled dinner out of 50% off at Sobeys which is amazing regular $16.99 on 50% off so I got two for the price of one now I can leave this sitting out in the porch for a while it's not gonna go bad um, it's good until <laughs> December 26, 2020. Yeah, so I'm not going to be cooking this anytime right soon, but I'll make sure it stays in a really cold place and we'll be good. But I want to take advantage while I can because that stuff can get pretty pricey. Please, but just watch out for a second. All right, friends. Well, I'm sorry I haven't picked Jap in a while. It's 348. Mally just made some spaghetti because she wants to use the new stove. This isn't the greatest look at it. Watch out, Bob. But I'm going to open this up. You got to watch out. Skedaddle. Look how nice and shiny. There's no hole in the glass or anything. Mally even made her cake today. It's a red velvet cake mix. But I'm going to start dishing this up now. It's a little early, but it's all cooked and ready and hot. And they can eat. So, yeah. Spaghetti's on the menu. Whew, all right, guys. Well, it's about 8 o'clock at night. I meant to show you Mally's cake, but I'll show you it tomorrow in tomorrow's video. But I'm going to end this video now. It's just been popping in the past couple of days, not like full day videos. I'm sorry about that. It's just we're all still adjusting to this new way of life. <laughs> and it's hard to sit down at the end of the day without being completely exhausted to try to edit without being interrupted and stuff. So I'm going to end it now while I can. Tomorrow is Mally's 13th birthday. She's turning 13. I can't believe it. She's no more preteen. She's just going to be a teenager. And she acts every single bit of being a teenager now. But I oh, hear Maze coming upstairs. I'm still on there. You'll have to just wait a minute. Anyways, guys, I'm going to say peace, love, and happiness today and every single day. Please like, share, and subscribe if you so choose. But if not, that's okay, too. I still love you. I still want all the happiness in the world for each and every one of you out there. I certainly do. I really, really honest and truly do. Yes, I do. So I will try really hard tomorrow to get Mally's birthday video up on her actual birthday. I'll try. I'll try. So <laughs> with that, I'll say have a good night or have a good morning. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye. Boink.